Hello, I'm Daniel, and welcome to the Amuna Project. We here at the Amuna Project are continuing in our series of videos with respect to inspiration, information, education, and guidance, advice to Noahides, converts to Judaism, and to uh, Bali Chuva, returnees to Judaism, people who were born Jewish and are now returning after a period of time to Hashem, to the Creator, and to Judaism. And um, there's an interesting expression in the Bible where the Jewish people are called the children of God, the children of Hashem. And um, it's very interesting uh, because often we're called B'nai Israel, the children of Israel, descendants from uh, Jacob. So why we, why does the, uh, the book of Deuteronomy first verse of chapter 14 call us the children of God because God is the creator if that's the case then all people are children of of God where do Jews get the distinction of being the children of God uh, as opposed to everybody else and um, it's um, Harav Elimelech um, Mahler who says, we get this distinction because we are the people who have received and have kept the Torah. Uh, that is what makes us the children of God, uh, by what we've learned, by what we've instilled in ourselves, and by what we transmit to our children. Uh, just as God is our teacher when it comes to Torah, so we too our teachers when we teach our children and and similarly the um, the relationship between a uh, Rebbe and his uh, students and his Talmidim is often referred to as referred in previous videos the teacher student relationship is the Re the Rebbe Talmud relationship is very much like uh, like a parent and uh, like a child a teacher is like a parent and when um, when uh, the Prophet Elisha witnessed uh, the prophet Elijah being uh, taken up to heaven on the chariots of fire. He cried, my father, my father, my father. Uh, chariots of Israel and their riders. Ironically, when Elisha died, King uh, Yehovash, uh, Yehoash said the same thing, my father, my father chariots of Israel and their riders. A teacher is like a father, a parent, the student to a good teacher um, is like their child. And um, when this relationship, how is this, how do we flesh out this relationship? In Hebrew, the word more, teacher, it derives from the same root as the word to conceive. When you teach someone, when you instill them with Torah beliefs and Torah knowledge and Torah truths, the person that you're teaching, in effect, becomes a new person. He becomes different. He becomes a new person. And you've helped in creating that person, just like a parent um, helps create uh, the child. Um, when Moses was reluctant to go to Pharaoh, I'm slow of speech and slow of tongue, God says, I will, te I will teach you what to say. I will teach you what to say. And um, in so doing, he, God, the Creator, changed Moses from a very reluctant uh, leader into the greatest prophet uh, of all time. Um, the, the relationship between a religious leader and his congregation, between a teacher and his student, between God and us, that is what makes us the children of God. That's what makes us the children of God. Our clinging to the Torah, our clinging to God, our learning, our becoming new people. It's this relationship, this birth, that makes us the children of God. 
Um, we will be doing more videos along these lines. Please come back, please watch, please learn. And until next time, on behalf of the Mona Project, I'm Daniel, and thank you too much.